life is really too pale. Oh, welcome back guys. God, nice blue skies again. It's still uh, well, about minus 10. We had a temperature drop since the last time I spoke to you. Um, and quite a bit of snow, um, which is somewhat a bit of a contradiction. Uh, the snow means it's getting warmer, obviously. But uh, after it did snow, the temperature dropped again. So this snow is here to stay for a few, another week or so, because it's just frozen solid. Shut up. Uh, guys, uh, a couple of things to talk about today. Um, I'm heading on into the university. It's uh, not to do any work, of course, just doing a sort of recce mission um, with regard to my new schedule for the semester. I've had uh, the new schedule now for a couple of weeks, but uh, there's a couple of room number changes, so I like to be prepared. But it's a good excuse to get out. I've also uh, managed to pick up well, I had the delivery of my Joby bendy tripod thing, which is awesome. I don't know, it's, it's really good. It's bendy legs and it does say Joby, yeah, somewhere. It's got a quick release light here. I think we all know how this stuff works, but I don't know if it's genuine. Uh, let me know. Here's the box that came in. Uh, it looks pretty genuine. Uh, but you can never be too sure. about 600 koi for this, um, which is about, I don't know, 55, 60 quid. But that includes the the ball head, adjustable ball head on top as well. So, which obviously the quick release plate and the little level thing, which I don't think anyone really uses. But anyway, okay, let's go back to where he is. So there we go. It's uh. It's a pretty good piece of kit, actually. Now, the other thing, you might notice, what the hell am I traveling on here? But you probably guess it's uh, one of these segways. Uh, quite an interesting story here, actually. The uh, Segway um, is, of, Segway is obviously uh, an American company. And uh, China, being China, likes to make their own versions of these uh, things and uh, their version is called Ninebot so it's a, it's a knockoff of of the Segway Segway were very happy about this obviously and uh, decided to sue Ninebot the Chinese company and basically what happened is Ninebot decided to buy out Segway so <laughs> Segway is still about obviously but now it's a Chinese company and Ninebot can go about and do whatever they want so you've got two brand names funny thing is this is the one this is what I bought here But uh, yeah, here's the kicker. When I bought this, which is obviously, it's a fraction of the price of what you can buy in the West. I mean, okay, it's not a genuine product. I knew that when I bought it, but I thought it was uh, obviously the Ninebot version. The, the guy told me that I have to download this particular app on my iPhone in order to use it and what have you. So I thought, well, okay, it's, it's a third party app. Why? And I did wonder why, why I can't download the Ninebot app from the Apple Store, which, which I did as well anyway, but it doesn't work. And the reason it doesn't work 
is because of this, this machine is a knockoff. This is a knockoff of the Chinese version of Ninebot, which is a knockoff of Segway. A knockoff of a knockoff of a Segway. It's just <laughs> incredible. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, so here we are, guys. Let's uh, let's head on in. Now, hopefully, in a few weeks' time. Well, probably three or four weeks' time. I'm going to be uh, I'll be doing another video on electric bikes. Um, I've got one myself, obviously, and I uh, don't like riding it into the <laughs> in the winter because it's so damn cold. The wind chill kills you. So this is why I opted for the Segway, because it, it's a little bit slower and uh, you don't get quite so cold and I can't bother to walk. Oh shit. Um, I can go over this. No I can't. Oh, shit! It's interesting, lots of Christmas trees here actually. <laughs> These are the old blue spruces, I think. I haven't really noticed that before. Oh well. These are the things that people in the West like chopping down and using, as, uh, using to decorate their homes with. <laughs> Strange practice. Anyway, here we go. Oh my God. They ain't gonna let me in, I don't think. Locked. Shit. That's annoying. All right, we've got a sign here. What the hell does that say? 15th of the second. 16th of the second. And the date today is the 10th. So I'm early. I'm way too early. Shit. So much for being organized. Hands are frozen. Ow! Oh, I'm gonna end up coming off this in a minute. It's the trouble is, I can't see what's under the snow. I've got to say, what a beautiful day. I mean, there's so much for pollution in China, right? My beard is freezing. It's getting crunchy. The water vapor coming out of my mouth. Condensing on my beard. Or mustache. Okay. Oh. Oh, yeah. Well, that's kind of a wasted journey, but never mind. It's nice to get back out on uh, on Herbie again. So yeah, as I said, hopefully uh, next two or three weeks should be getting out to um, buy a new e-bike. Pretty amazing thing. So I'll throw some pictures up so you can see the type of uh, type of thing I'm on about. Incredible uh, speeds of you know plus 50 miles an hour for an electric bike. It's amazing. Um, acceleration just as fast. And uh, yeah, it looked just like real motorbikes. Oh my god, my hands are freezing. Ah, I forgot about that as well. I should have brought my gloves. Time to go home, I think, because my ears are starting to freeze too. I had uh, someone comment on one of my videos. Uh, I was a bit sort of taken aback by it I suppose. Um, one of my videos was talking about uh, how there's no violent crime in China. Now when I say no violent crime I, I don't really expect anyone to take me quite so literally. Um, and I'm sure people don't. I mean no such thing as zero violent crime, right? There we go. Done it again. Oh, why? So, oh, for f**k's sake, I'm gonna kill myself. 
Yeah, so uh, one of my videos mentioned that, you know, no, zero, the, well, I, I can't remember what I said now, but I said there's no violent crime in China. And I, I don't really expect everyone to take me co completely literally on that. And I, I, I try to explain to her because she, she spoke to me about a story. Wow, she's <laughs> incredible what she said. Um, I mean, you can have a look on the, the comments section. But uh, she was talking about how she was attacked the other week, or well, last Saturday. Uh, some guy was waiting for her in the hallway outside her apartment with a knife. Uh, she's trying to tell me that he didn't want to rob her, he wanted to rape her at knife point in the hallway outside her apartment. And I can only assume it was some Chinese guy. As far as I'm aware, Chinese people don't really do that kind of thing. I mean, never say never, right? It's always, you can always find cases of, of bad things happening. There's always, there's bad people wherever you go in the world, but you won't find as many in China, as far as I'm concerned anyway. And as I explained to her in the message, you know, you still, women are always gonna be a lot more vulnerable than men at all times and you know common sense prevails you regardless of where you're living in the world but on balance as I as I said in the in my reply to her that China you know hands down is 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 much safer place to place to live because I was a bit dubious about her story and as I again as I said in the message to her I, I thought the story sounded a bit fantastical um, but I'm inclined to believe her, obviously. <laughs> you know, that's, that's a pretty, pretty scary thing for anything, for anyone to, to go through. So, I just find it extremely difficult to, to get my head around that. And as I, as I explained to, to her, there's many vloggers in China, and they'll all say the same as me, you know, how violent crime is, is pretty much non-existent. Yeah, I don't want to give people the wrong impression. I mean, she did say to me that uh, that perhaps I, I shouldn't sort of generalize too specifically that way, <laughs> if it's such a thing. Give people the wrong idea about China. And she said, you know, to use the word lie. And I don't think I'm lying, you know, I'm, I'm generalizing, obviously. Um, as, as most people do, but you know, 99% out of 100, you're not going to come across any violent crime here in China. Uh, I mean, you'll, you'll find it. If you're looking for it, you'll find it. I'm not saying that she was, but you've got to be bloody unlucky. So that's bad enough that I'm a foreigner. Get funny looks as it is. Um, let alone riding around on a Segway and holding a bloody great camera out in front of me doing a vlog, so I stick out like a sore thumb. God, it's freezing. Look at that. I don't know who catch the blue skies. Beautiful. Jesus Christ, how many people are going to fit in a lift?